we now have all of the evidence that we need to answer this chapter two question. So when you are ready, I'd like you to pause the video and to write an explanation to the Econauts that supports a claim about what caused the carbon dioxide in the air to decrease and how this impacted the biodome overall. And as you do that, I'd like you to use our terms here in the word bank um, in your writing. So let's check our work. Are you able to circle or underline all of these terms in this word bank in your explanation? If you're not, pause the video again and revise your writing so that you can include all of these terms. Lastly, let's check that our explanation not only has all of the science terms that we need to accurately explain what caused the carbon dioxide in the atmosphere to decrease, but let's also make sure that our explanation has the claim, evidence, and reasoning components that we know a good science argument needs. Um, so I have a couple of sentence starters here on the board. And I would like you to check your work and see if you mentioned um, some similar things. So did you start off with a claim around the cause of this carbon dioxide decrease and how that connects to a population um, of organisms within the biodome? Next, did you include evidence in your explanation from both that graph of Dr. Corey's as well as our SIM investigation. And then lastly, have you clearly explained um, why this decrease in decomposers is important, how that connects to cellular respiration and carbon dioxide, and what that means overall for our ecosystem, and how that helps explain why our ecosystem collapsed. Again, if you're missing one of these pieces in your explanation, pause the video and go back and revise your work. Wow, we just figured out a really huge piece of our puzzle um, about why our biodome uh, didn't work for our Econauts and how they can make it better next time. Um, so as we reflect on chapter two, it would be great if you could share your explanation with someone else to show off how proud you are of yourself uh, for figuring out all of these really um, intricate connections between the components of our ecosystem. And if you want to spend some time reviewing what we figured out so far, or you'd like to give yourself an additional challenge, and you have access to Amplify Online, go ahead and complete the critical juncture assessment in the next lesson, which is lesson 2.4, as well as complete the um, review and extension activity that follows in lesson 2.5, where you're going to further investigate some of these claims that the Econauts have about their um, failed biodome experiment. Have fun, and I'll see you next time.